What's up, guys? The Rogue Budger here with Unashamed Gaming, bringing you another Team Tactical game today on this fine Thursday. Um, this is going to be, of course, me and Josh playing uh, Team Tactical. It's going to be headquarters on a showdown. And I know that you can see uh, at the bottom, it's a pretty darn long video. Um, but my kill count makes up for it, I think. Um, in my mind, it was a pretty large amount of kills for... <laughs> Uh, that was embarrassing. But it was a pretty large amount of kills for a team tactical, which is 3v3. Um, so sit back and enjoy that. I'm not going to be able to talk for the whole 15 minutes. I just want to briefly address something. Um, Black Ops 2 has now been released backwards compatible for Xbox One, um, which is great. Black Ops 2 is probably my second favorite Call of Duty, um, or it's at least top three. And... It is the most competitive Call of Duty in my mind, um, so I'm hoping to play it and get some gameplay up with that, um, depending on whether or not I get an account. As you all know, my account troubles uh, over the past few months with Xbox, I haven't dealt with it any since, so we'll see if I have the time or the ability to, to get an account and play. Um, I don't really want to play by myself, but maybe if I can play it with some people, um, that could be amusing. So. If you do have Black Ops 2, all you got to do if you have an Xbox One is just put in your disc and you can download it backwards compatibility um, to the Xbox One. Um, a few things to take note of. This is mostly coming from Enos, but it is... Uh, you are on the same servers as people from the 360s and the servers are kind of overloaded right now because so many people are on it. Um, so that being said, keep... or you want know, to keep that in mind. Um, he also said it's very hard to kill people who are still on 360s, uh, just because the cross, I don't know, just the cross server, uh, connection there is a little shaky. Uh, so we'll see if that improves in the coming weeks with a little bit of tweaking now that they kind of know, uh, what to expect, but I don't know what that shaking is on screen there. Um, but it sounds like a lot of fun and I definitely want to try it out because I miss Black Ops 2. It was a fun game. I love playing it. Um. And it's certainly, certainly worth downloading to play backwards compatible if you if you have the ability to do so. Um, I would highly recommend it. But uh, if you do that, leave in the comments how it is, um, how you if you have any connection issues, stuff like that, your experience with it, and let me know. Uh, I'll be interested to hear if other people are having the same trouble as Enos has um, before I go and spend money on Xbox Live. But. That's going to do it for me for this commentary, but of course the video has got a good long ways left for you guys to enjoy. I'm just going to throw some music on the background. Remember, it's just a just a kind of a lot of kills for a, a 3v3 in my mind. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy it. hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. I should be back on Monday, assuming I don't forget again like I did this week. Um, as always, guys, God bless. We will see you next time.
Thank you.